Hello from the West Coast and mille grazie to Laura Caricetoli Theater, Casa Italiana and the Italian Cultural Institute. And congratulations Angelina from Cherry Lane Theater. I am just so touched uh, with this award. I met Laura nine years ago. It was at the first in Shana and I had just started a community arts program. So I introduced myself and told her there was a new theater, the Bernie Wall Center on the Upper West Side. So we started talking and in the conversation, she heard that my mom was born in Calabria. Hey, si se conoce Laura, she needed no other information. And we booked the show the following month. Well, since that time, I've seen the fabulous Laura grace the stage of the Bernie Wall Center with a one woman show, direct plays in English and Italian. And I had the good fortune of seeing so many plays from Italy, from comedy to children's theater to intense dramas. These plays were sometimes filled with humor, were very reflective and questioning life. They showed how theater transcends boundaries and brings humanity together. The Italians, the Italian Americans, the international theater lovers all flocked to see the shows. But there were other people in the audience. They were the people from Goddard Riverside. Goddard Riverside is the big social services organization on the Upper West Side, parent to the Bernie Wall Center. And sometimes in the audience, there'd be someone who had been formerly homeless, people who had never been to live theater or couldn't afford to go, some suffering from mental illness, and many older adults. In Shana certainly attracted a diverse audience. And um, there was one show I remember in particular, it was a show on bullying in Italian. And we invited some of the teens from Goddard Riverside to come. Well, they grudgingly accepted to see a play that wasn't even in English. Well, we did lure them with a pasta dinner. And this event that night showed what a universal language theater is. These reluctant teens participated in one of the best talkbacks I ever heard. And over the years, I'd often get a call from Laura, so sad, I'm thinking about, oh no. <laughs> and it would be something wonderful and spectacular. And it would happen because Laura always makes things happen. Laura e la mia famiglia italiana, no calabrese, I love New York. And Thinking about my family coming from Sicily, Veneto, and yes, Calabria. I remember the stories some people in my mom's hometown, Spezzano della Sila, told me about a donkey in a cart carrying her along with her brother and mother down the hill to cross that big ocean to America. Eh, impossibile. It would have just been impossible for my mother to imagine that her daughter would be here virtually accepting an award for a role she played in helping to bring Italian theater to New York. They were on a voyage to a new land and a new opportunity and could never have imagined that just a generation later, we would so embrace what is Italy. In fact, my brother just got his Italian citizenship. I think I should use his documents to get mine. Well, I'm now retired. And this is the first in Shana I have not worked on. I, I did uh, stumble across Our Lives Matter Theater Company here in California where I live and I've been writing some grants for them. Ma, I have a dream to work with in Shana again and bring it to the West Coast. Laura, sei pronta? My deepest gratitude goes to Laura and all the wonderful people I met through in Shana. Ciao, Donatella, and oh, so many others, but too many to name, but you know who you are. Buona fortuna a tutti. E vi ringrazio del profondo del mio cuore per avermi dato questo prezioso premio. Grazie e ciao.